Starliner's highly anticipated first crewed launch, which would have marked Sunita Williams' third journey to space, has been called off. Scheduled to launch from Kennedy Space Center at 8.04 a.m. India time, the Atlas V rocket was grounded just 90 minutes before liftoff due to a technical glitch, pushing the mission to a later date. NASA explained that an oxygen relief valve malfunction prompted the delay. Astronauts Sunita Williams and Barry Butch Wilmore were buckled up and ready to go when they had to exit the spacecraft safely. Now, both await a second launch attempt. Although the next launch window could be Tuesday night, no immediate decision has been made. A successful launch would have positioned Boeing as the second commercial crew transportation provider to the International Space Station after Elon Musk's SpaceX. Part of NASA's commercial crew program, the mission sought to test the Starliner's capabilities from launch to docking, concluding with a safe return to Earth in the western United States. NASA's current approach favors buying these services from the private sector instead of managing them in-house. This failure is another blow for Boeing, whose aviation division is already under pressure due to a series of accidents. The Starliner was originally set for an uncrewed test flight in 2015, but faced software glitches that pushed its first attempt to 2019. The following attempt was slated for August 2021, but delayed to May 2022 due to propulsion issues. Despite these hurdles, the Starliner managed to complete its mission. For Sunita Williams, this would have been a significant milestone. She became a NASA astronaut in 1998 and has already undertaken two space missions in 2006, 7 and 2012. During her career, she completed four spacewalks totaling 29 hours and 17 minutes, setting remarkable records for female astronauts.